everyone, Sanjonani. My name is Mbumelelo Utelezi. I am a visual practitioner born and bred in Soweto in a neighborhood called Pumbo. My medium of practice is photography and journalism. I studied photography at the Market Photo Workshop in 2017. I did a program called Photojournalism and Documentary Photography Program, which deals with media. I am the 2021 Kassiri Awards Award recipient, um, which is sponsored by Strauss and Co, NAC and Vasa. The Kassiri Awards Award is a three-month uh, access residency program, which is supported alongside Dark Fachi and Dark Fachi student artists and Dark Fachi staff at large to develop an independent body of work, which turned out to be a solo exhibition. The work is titled Lugus Yusulani Sao, which simply means separating yourself. So initially, I had many questions and controversial questions asking myself uh, during the national lockdown as to why is the national lockdown separating us from things that we're used to doing. So I started pointing the camera at myself and asking all these questions of what is it to be human in the spiritual realm of things? Uh, what is it to be human in this precarious or doomed world that we're living in? And how can we separate ourselves uh, from things that we love? You know, since I predominantly come from a Seven Day Adventist, so the national lockdown pandemic has separated myself and my family and people that are spiritually um, alienated with their religion. You know, I was not used to not going to communal spaces like churches, you know, parks you know uh, and then from there i started pointing the camera at myself and sort of de-stressing and reflecting and doing self-introspective of who i am as a human being what are angels of god depicted as are they creatures are they are they animals are they females are they males you know and also having all these um questions of what 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 life is in uh, living like in in these precarious times of COVID-19. And then from there, I started infusing different materials as, as props to also be intentional in, in my photography because of now I'm tapping into fine art photography and portrait photography, you know, which is one medium that I struggle, you know, um, uh, shooting, you know. So it was a learning process and it still is, you know, and um, I was specifically uh, grateful and honored for the experience because of now I can point the camera at myself and sort of cleanse myself and purify myself, you know, and trying to connect with the higher power, you know, and finding divinity in pointing the camera at myself and questioning all issues that are affecting me in my own individuality, you know, as a man and asking myself, what does it mean to be man? You know, how can I cleanse myself? How can I purify myself? You know, with all the issues that are affecting us. And because of we are not vocal about our issues as men, you know, we're always bottling them inside our hearts. But with this body of work, I was able to sort of be vocal through my stylistic approach of how I anticipated the project, um, which is self projector and also infusing my friends as well once the national lockdown started, you know, um, opening doors and avenues um, to us and I started infusing them, asking them questions of how did it affect them, what are they going through, what issues are they facing um, as men in their own individualities uh, since they are also men. First and foremost, I'm specifically grateful and honoured to Back Factory Artist Studio for giving me the opportunity uh, to showcase my skill and talent. Uh, during my artist residency program and I was also honored um, for developing this independent body of work alongside a curator who has assisted me during the process of how to develop my work, how to narrow it down, how to construct uh, a core essence of what the story is about and how to develop it into a solid, legit, um, independent body of work. My name is Talifi Maditi and thank you to Back Factory um, artists as well who were on board during my 
critique session, my mentor sessions that we were having uh, according to our scheduling of um, the process and the program. Uh, one of them is Pumlani and Duli and also we had invited a, a photographer that I've always um, looked and then get got inspired by his work and his style of approach which is in Tate um, uh, Andrew Shabango and also to backpack his stuff you know with the knowledge and the understanding of of them trying to not not trying to say but guiding me in a sense of being able to be vocal about my work and how to be confident about what I say in terms of my images but yeah thanks and I'm humbled.